Hey guys, it's Shannon and Paul, and welcome to the Collector Corner. That's right. Where today we are opening up a Pop Mart Street Fighter figures. Awesome. So here's the front of the packaging. Ten different figures to collect, including a secret, which probably has the um, chase percentage on it there. I can't see. It Does it not? Doesn't say. Maybe 108. Maybe They're one. They're pretty one, hard. One in every one. Yeah, one in yeah. every. Yeah, that would still be one in every 12 boxes. Yep. That's going to be tough to find. Yes. Okay, who do you want the most? I'm looking at the side so here. So definitely Chun Li. Um, she was she was always my go-to character. Um, I always tend to with fighting games. I always tend to like the characters that can move a little bit quicker, but do a little bit less damage. You trade some agility for power, but I was always okay with that. And Chun Li was always my favorite. Character. Is this Cammy? Cammy. I want Cammy. Okay. I didn't play the game, so I don't know yeah. the characters. That's okay. But just based on the figures or this one. Yeah, that one's cool. Now I do not remember her. Lurry. Lurry or Fury? I or? can't see. It's really small. It's like a little cat character. So, I have no idea. Oh, and Chun-Li. So, I'm going to her a little cyclone kick or whatever it was called. Oh, I, oh, this guy, Um, I do not remember his name. He was played by Jean-Claude Jean -Claude Van Damme in the Street Fighter the movie, which was a ridiculous. Ghoul? Ghouly? G U I L E. Oh, Guile. Guile. Guile? Now I remember him. I, okay. I, I, I knew the character. I knew him from the game. I just could not remember the name. So remember. he's like the little American Army commando guy. <sighs> little camouflage pants on, bloused boots, like that. Green he can tank stand top. on his head. Yeah, he can. Um, <laughs> these are not standard issue t shirts for any military people. Uh, they always are short sleeve, never tank tops. So I don't just think that's standard issue hair. A fun fact. Uh, that is within regulations. It's, it's a flat top. Completely that, flat? You can have a flat top? You sure can. Do you know how much hairspray you need to put in your hair? You'd be flammable. So the hair would be so short it would stand up on its own. Mm, um, not his. Not his, no. Okay, so this is a pretty cute collector card it comes with. It's like a little handheld video game. Oh, that's cool. Uh, controller. Yeah. There he is. His little thumbs up. <laughs> I didn't see. Okay. Is this my base? Ah, I have E Honda. Yep. He's like, Honda is my favorite car <laughs> brand. I like Honda. Yep. It's his name, Honda. It is. I e like Honda. Hondas too. Yeah. <laughs> All right. I used to have a Toyota. Now I have a Honda. It's just the way it goes. Yep. All right. He is a really cool figure. So he's. Um, I think it's just a sumo wrestler. Yeah, sumo wrestler. He had this cool move where he could cool. like do his hands like really, really fast. Oh yeah. Yeah, I, I like him. He was probably my second, second favorite character to play, maybe. Um, but he was very, he was a slow moving, like a lot of damage kind of guy. He's funny. His hair up top here reminds me of if you go to the pet store and buy fish. It looks like a fish bag. They clamp it, it and does. you have the little <laughs> fish <You> bag. <laughs> <are right. laughs> Actually, Blanca. Of, of the figures we get, Blanca was my second favorite. Honda was my next. Okay. Oh, it's Hondo, not Honda? No, it's Honda. Oh, okay. Honda. You had it right. Okay. Um, We can't get a Zangief. The Russian wrestler guy. Also from Wreck-It Ralph. Oh, I have the one that you were thinking of. I have no idea what this one's name is, but it's cool looking figure. Lurie? Let's see. I'll show you the card. Lurie? Yeah. L I don't know if that's an L or a J. It's kind Jury? of hard to tell. Oh, it's like a spider. She has like a spider spider on her back, which is all oh, the little cool. straps of her front, her little top. She has spiked wristbands on and little pink gloves. Um, she has like white chap pants on, which are fun. Little like stirrup shoes and then pink tights or something underneath. She's awesome. She is awesome. I love the colors. I like the pose also. She's up on one foot. Like, you know, I'm gonna do like the Daniel Daniel LaRusso crane kick on you. There is no defense. If I was gonna be a character, I would be her. I, I would like her outfit. Totally <laughs> I could totally picture that. Alright. I'm gonna just pick Yeah. 
pick a couple. Okay, so... Normally we keep them behind us, but they almost fell on Jack, okay. so I wanted to move them. Okay. Yeah, so they works. didn't hit. Jack is sleeping. Jack's our cat, in case you're new to the channel, but he's sleeping on the floor right next to the yeah. trash can where we balance our boxes of stuff. Yep. He was in danger. Ooh, all right, I have the head... Poncho himself. Yep. Front of the box, Ryu. Is it Ryu or Ryu? Or, or Ryu. Ryu. <laughs> <laughs> I never pronounce it right. It's, Neither do it, I. It, it's, it's like Ryu. It, it's it's R Y U. Kanga is my mother. <laughs> Kanga is not his mother. <laughs> if his name is Ryu. Yeah. Kanga and Ryu. Yep. <laughs> okay, he's really cute though. He is. I love his hair. Yep. It's like little artichoke, spiky hair. Yep. The gloves. He just looks like a classic karate yeah, pr dude. Prototypical anime hair. Yeah. Has the uh, the classic karate gi with the sleeves ripped off, so he's kind of Cobra Kai-ish. Um, yeah, because they don't usually have ripped up no, things, but no. he's he's fine like that. Yeah. <laughs> there he is. He had the little like chi, chi blast that he could do. Which was nice, because that was a projectile he could launch. Oh, I have, um, this is like Sailor Moon. Sakura. So I do not remember her. She was in a, she was in like a later version of the game. Looks very, very much like a Street Fighter version of Sailor Moon. Yes. I like the little red Converse tennis shoes and the blue Lululemon skirt. <laughs> and then the little half top Sailor not top. Not sponsored by Lululemon. Yeah. Lululemon was not out when. <laughs> this game was out, I'm They sure. probably took the design of that and like, we should make a skirt like that. Probably did. You could go right from tennis to street fighting. <laughs> without missing a beat. There you go. That should be an exercise yeah. class at the gym. Street fighting. It should be. Okay. Oops, here's my stand. And I have... Ken. So, like, Ryu's brother, or, like, counterpart, basically. He was just a different version of Ryu. Basically, the exact same moves, same ability, just... I put him on version. his face backwards. I'm oh. gonna have to fix that. Okay, I'll fix that in a minute. Well, he he, he was bothering up, me. He could be lining up for a spinning back kick. He could. Now, he has a much more classic uniform in that it's not ripped up, but yes. I feel like they always have sleeves on him. Not sleeveless. Oh, yeah. Yeah, they do. So. The only sleeveless one I've ever seen in my life was in Karate Kid, the Cobra Kai. Uh, I could see this being you when you were you? little. Little blonde haired. You yeah, know, I could have seen that. Karate dressed up. Of course, for you, it would have been Ninja. Yes, it would have been. Because that, um, that was Paul's career aspirations, I think, when he was little. Ninja. Truer than you could imagine. <laughs> what do you want to be when you grow up? A ninja. Yeah, which violates the first rule of being a ninja when you grow up. Don't tell anybody you're a ninja. Oh, I have Cammy. So here's little Cammy. She's fun. She was a special forces operative. I think yeah, she was like the she's U cool. like the UK version. I love her. Yep. I love her braids. Yep, she has little blonde braids, a red beret, a green leotard, and little fingerless red gloves, and then combat boots. And fun fact, that is actually how the Special Forces dress over in the UK. Yeah, I am sure it is. <laughs> You're not going to hear anything about that at yeah. all. <laughs> they learned that from all the uh, superhero movies. <laughs> all, the, all the female characters out there. Yeah. All right, this is going to be my last one, and then Paul has one more. Come on, special. We didn't get the special edition yet, right? We haven't found the special yet. Okay. I have... Oh, this is a fun one. Blanca? Yep. Blanca! The Brazilian little green guy, he could electrify. He was cool. But he, he could also turn into a ball like Buzz saw you. He should be white if he's Blanca. He should be, I agree. He's green, not yeah. white. Well, he's not Blanco. He's Blanca. <laughs> Is Blanco Blanca. Spanish for white? I thought it was Blanca. It's, it's Blanco? It's Blanca. What's green? Ver, ve, verde? I think so. Something. I think you're right. Okay. I know red is Rojo. So was he, um, were there like 
villains and not, or were they all kind of just the same and it was just which one you liked? Yeah, it was just who you liked, really. Okay. Now, once the movie came out, they kind of made villains and whatever. Obviously, the Americans and the uh, and the people from the UK were the were the good guys. Zangief from Russia was a bad guy. Got it. Okay. Um, yeah. He just he looks a little moody. I think he I think he was on the villain team. I can't remember. I like I really love the expression on his yeah. face. And he's cool. He doesn't actually have any little pegs. He's yep. just gonna kneel his little superhero on the base. Alright, we are missing one character for the nine. That's Chun Li. And then of course oh, no. the special. So I Uh oh. I you want wanted, both. Yeah. I want both. I'll take the special because I can get it. I can get another box of these and probably get Chun Li. Yay, I have Chun Li. <laughs> So she is awesome. This is the classic Chun Li outfit right here. She's kind of like she's kind of like a modest Princess Leia who has the little cinnamon bun ears, but covers them up with little bonnets. Yeah. So that way they stay nice. She's in she's in the horse stance. That's actually a stance in in different styles of karate. That's that's like, don't come at me, but come at me. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. <laughs> exactly. She's giving mixed messages there. She is. She Stay, is. She's wearing the again. little uh, the the gown that's like split all the way to the hip. Very cool. I like the spiked bracelets. I don't remember those from the game, but it, they probably were. Everything else is accurate. Very cool. She could do like this upside down like spinny kick thing. Uh, <laughs> that was pretty that cool. That would be pretty cool. But, but the thing that I really liked is she could do like this really fast kick where like this leg would go up and just like do kick all around and everything. <laughs> it was like a whirlwind. It was pretty cool. I'm sure it so, was. She there was you go. she was my favorite character. I remember Mortal Kombat. I remember them more too. Than Street Fighter. And when they get figures of those, we'll get those too. Yeah. I'm going with Chun Li as my favorite. Okay. No girl question. power. Yep. I'm going with whatever her name is. Kitty Cat Kick Girl. Yeah. Jury, Jury or, or Lurie. Lurie. Fury. She's awesome. She Except is. I don't like the spider yeah. top. Yeah, it's kind of weird. It could just have straps, but no spider. No middle. spider. <laughs> All right, how about you guys? Which one of these did you like the best? Leave a comment down below. Let us know. Leave the video a thumbs up if you enjoy. Hit the share button. Make sure to subscribe if you haven't already. It's going to make you part of the Collector Corner Club, where I do not know if Blanca is, means white or not. All right, we'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching. Bye, guys.